All right, you guys, sorry. I was just doing a Dollar Tree haul. I need to hurry up and my iPod fell. <laughs> yeah, huh. never fails, right? So I wanna show y'all what I got um, at another Dollar Tree haul. I just went to Walmart to go get me another one of those t-shirts that I've had, that I've been buying. I have a blue, gray, um, black, and a uh, hot pink, and they're super cute, you guys. Anyway, so let me get started again. <coughs> <coughs> Great, I was doing fine until I started this video. I picked up this thing for my husband for Father's Day. It says, Dad's Garage, always open, fatherly advice, priceless. I don't know where I'm going to put it. There's really no, no place to put this, but, and it's, um, I've seen some of these at um, Hobby Lobby, and they're more than a dollar, so yeah, pick yours up now. Okay, I just noticed, you guys, that this thing is broken right here. Didn't notice it when I was holding on, and I'm hoping when I go back to the Dollar Tree um, to go trade this for another one hope there's more but there weren't a whole bunch so who knows but anyway this is cute i love the whole greenery stuff and it says bath rules start with hot water soak relax unwind enjoy the quiet time bubble your troubles away and i'm really loving the whole greenery thing i'm i don't know why i'm just falling in love with all the greenery stuff now so i picked that up except that won't last long because i got to take it back to, to the dollar tree see the talk see talking about the greenery i saw another one that said love this is super cute you don't have to keep it white if you don't want you can spray paint the, the back if you want but i'm gonna leave it like that i'm gonna put it where my movies are in my living room and it's just perfect and look at this stuff like this could cost you about four or five dollars um depending i guess at um walmart uh not anything wrong with that but i'd rather pay a buck for it and walmart has some really cute stuff with the greenery oh so pretty anyway so I picked this up, super cute. <clears throat> and then they're starting to sell frames again. I am really surprised because for some reason, it's like everybody wanted to go buy frames uh, at the Dollar Tree because last year when that whole, the whole COVID thing started, um, I couldn't find any pretty frames. So they're starting to sell these really pretty frames again. And I just got the white one. I thought that was super pretty. Um, they even had some turquoise color ones with gold around it. They have black with gold around it. Really cute, you guys. So go check out your Walmart. I bought one of these just in case. Uh, I haven't made any rings um, for, probably for over a month. But the, they're starting to sell these at, Walmart, at the Dollar Tree. And these are just called Lobster Claws. And you know how much these could be maybe at, I don't know. I'm thinking maybe a couple dollars at Walmart. But if you get them at Hobby Lobby, I don't know what the price would be because I never buy them but so I bought that just in case I need it for like I said I haven't really been hanging out in my craft room and doing anything in there and then I picked up these jump rings um I might need them for something I don't know they're all silver but that's all right it's cute you know what uh do they open because it'd be cute to just make a bracelet with a whole bunch of these just clean them together or attach them but you know what I don't see any okay I don't have my glasses on but who knows I'll check them out later <clears throat> I picked up one pack of stickers you know and me and stickers um, look like this and I'm pretty sure I don't have these because I don't remember the, the, the cute hands that's why I picked it up it's super cute and it's from John of course of course John you make the, the most awesomest I know that's not a word probably but uh, stickers I just love John stickers they're just so cute i just bought one <clears throat> um, i bought me these i just bought me one the other day at uh i think at um <clears throat> i don't know if it was a dollar tree i think it was um a toothbrush because since i've had that tickle in my throat for a few days you know i threw my toothbrushes away um try not to keep them too long my husband was surprised that i threw his away because my husband will use his toothbrush uh, until the thing is flattened. It looks like it's doing the split. Like, seriously, <clears throat> he couldn't figure out why I got rid of his toothbrush. I said, well, you've had that, you've had the sneezes, I said, and allergies going on. I was like, why not? He's, he was, he's so funny. Anyway, this is called the Dental Guru. Name brand, uh, maybe, let me see what it says. Aroma Guru. guru. So it's not, um, I don't think it's a... Uh, Green bar. I don't see green bar. Anyway, it says Dental Guru, and they're pretty small, but I figured, you know what? They're still, they're eco-friendly. They're charcoal toothbrushes, so I said, you know what? Why not? I'm always buying toothbrushes just to have in case, like, my mom comes over, or the girls come over, or not come over because Brianna lives in the 
the back, but in my um the place where we fixed up for them. But Br Natasha's gonna be coming over, uh, moving into <laughs> yeah, we're gonna have a whole household of people again. Excuse me. Um, they're looking for another apartment. Just real quick, they thought they had an apartment that they were gonna get on the fifteenth of July. Turns out those people were beating around the bush and giving them the runaround and all this, you know, whatever. <clears throat> so now they found out that they're not going to get that apartment. And um, so now they have to keep continue looking for another one. But I'm um, hoping they find one because um, they're going to be coming over on what well, she, she's moving out on the 5th of the, of the next month. But she's going to be coming living with us for a couple months or not a couple months. I'm sorry, a couple weeks or maybe a month. <clears throat> so that's going to be something. Her and her boyfriend are going to be staying at the house. Um, yeah, so <laughs> always good to have extra toothbrushes, even though they're grown up. You know, grown ups forget. Um, and then I saw this, and someone, I didn't see it with the other stuff. I mean, look how tiny it is. Okay, first of all, it's small. And I usually don't buy secret, but this says Outlast Sweat and Odor. Complete clean. <clears throat> just Let me just smell it real quick. Oh, it smells really good, you guys. I mean, for a dollar, you really can't beat it. It's like I said, it's half the size of the other ones. And you can see it doesn't give you a lot of product. But you know what? If it's something, um, sorry, am I like screaming at y'all? <laughs> um, something to try and then, you know, <clears throat> maybe they'll sell bigger ones. I don't know. Like I said, this is the only one that I saw that someone left. So I picked it up. It smells awesome though. And then I bought me another one of these. I gave my last one, I believe, to my mom. <coughs> they work pretty well. The other ones... The other ones that I've had, not like this, but just in general, my tweezers, they can't be any, this can't be any worse than the other ones I have. So, um, picked up another one, just tried out. I mean, they work pretty well, so why not? <coughs> Hold on, you guys. Now I gotta, see, these are the things that I've been, um, popping. <coughs> uh, tell ya. That is crazy. I'm sorry I keep coughing on my videos, but holy moly. Okay, a couple more things real quick. I found another pair of cute socks with the little, it's a pineapple and it's got the little furry thing on top. I have two other pairs that I bought from uh, Dollar Tree a while back and I love them. I wear them, I wear them all the time. Super cute. Two pairs for a dollar, you can't beat it. And then I saw this and I wasn't going to pick it up, but... <clears throat> Let me just see if it's a green briar. No, it's not. Dur Durham Enterprises. Okay, this is called Gimme. No snag, hair extension, styling brush. No catching, no pulling, detangle, volumize. It's smooth. <coughs> oh my gosh, I should be doing this video. <clears throat> Hold on, let me move the air conditioning away from my, my nose. It's stuffing me up. <clears throat> okay. It says extensions, weaves, and wigs, gentle brush. <clears throat> not a green briar product, but is this not awesome for a dollar? I don't know how much this is, like regular price, because I've never even heard of this brand. For some reason, it looks like a Walmart brand, but I don't know. But I figured I have another one that's really soft that I use on my hair. I used to, I usually use a comb because regular brushes hurt my head and pull my hair. But I figured, you know what? I'm going to give this a try. So, super soft, you guys. I don't know about those little those little things, though. I'm thinking if they would have maybe not put those <laughs> those things and just left that, it would have been better. But we'll see what happens. If it does bother me, I might just have to cut those little plastic things down. and just Because it has more other bristles. See that? But if you wear wigs or weaves or extensions, whatever, supposedly. So, um, that might be something good for y'all out there that do have that or like to wear those <clears throat> but yeah I thought I'd get it just to show y'all but that is it you guys I hope my butter's not melted oh my gosh I forgot about my butter that is it and uh sorry again for coughing so hard <laughs> I took that air conditioner away from my face and eh, it's not that now but I hope you enjoy your day you guys or the rest of your week and um, I'll talk to you in my next video okay bye